This is a video on how to do basic 3D modeling in AutoCAD 2011. In this drawing, we have a simple orthographic view of the part we want to model in 3D. So to start it off, we're going to go over to the workspace drop-down menu on the top left and select 3D Basics. When the ribbon bar has loaded up, the home ribbon bar has the basic 3D modeling tools for quick access. Next, we're going to head over to the view cube and hit the home button to see an isometric view of our drawing. Now notice on the right view representation of our block, we have a six inch gap on the bottom of it. So we're going to make a guideline for that right now of six inches. Now we will start our extrusion. If we use the extrude command and select four sides, all we will see extruded are surfaces. Now we don't want that, we want a solid part, so we're going to use a different command. We're going to use the box command, then we're going to select our base to input our height of 16. And there's our first block. So we're going to continue using the box command to make the left side at the height of 16 and also the right side also at the height of 16. Next we're going to switch to the view tab and change over to the realistic view to see our blocks. As you can see we have three individual blocks and now we would like to make it into one block only. So we're going to use the union command, select each individual block, press enter, and now it becomes one solid block. Now seeing at our front and right view, we have holes in our block as well. So we're going to head over back to the 2D wireframe view and use these two circles to create these holes. We're going to use the extrude command this time around because we don't need a solid, we just need a surface to have subtracted. So we're going to extrude out and then we're going to go back to the realistic view and see our two cylinders extruded out. Now to subtract it out to create the holes, we're going to use the subtract command. We're going to select the main block and we're going to select a two cylinder that's going to be subtracted, press enter, and there are our two holes.